Alex, just a tragic story, and authorities say it was completely preventable. Now this family is left mourning the loss of a father and a daughter. We're learning a little bit more about them tonight. Take a look at this photo. This was just released by the uh, Riverside County Sheriff's Department. This is 45-year-old Correctional Corporal Daniel Jax Jr., his daughter Hannah, just 19 years old. Now this happened just before 9 p.m. Sunday. This is Gilman Springs Road. It's a two-lane highway. It's an unincorporated Hemet. Now, authorities say the alleged drunk driver was heading westbound in his Chevy Silverado just east of Bridge Street when he crossed into the eastbound lanes, slamming into Jack's Honda head on. Take a look at the aftermath, what's left of those mangled cars on the side of the road there. Now, the Chevy being driven by 47 year old Scott Bales, he's now under arrest for two counts of homicide and DUI, as well as causing major injuries to his passenger. We now know it's a 45 year old man from Moreno Valley. Corporal Jacks and his daughter both died at the scene. And tonight, we're learning more about those victims. Jax began his service with the Riverside County Sheriff's Department back in 2008. He's since worked at the Indio Jail, the Palm Desert Station, and most recently, the John Benoit Detention Center. According to social media, Hannah was a dancer and a performer who loved going to concerts. Corporal Jax leaves behind a wife and son. Hannah, of course, a mother and a brother. Now, the CHP wants to remind everyone that DUI-related crashes, they're not considered accidents because they are completely preventable. The Jacks family should not have to be mourning these horrific losses tonight. No word yet on whether any vigils are planned for the victims, but we will keep you posted. For now, reporting live from Riverside, I'm Chelsea Edwards, Fox 11 News.